In a dramatic turn of events, Governor Ahmadou Umaru Fintiri finds himself entangled in a legal showdown with Abubakar Babazango, a.k.a. Abaza, a prominent member of the Adamawa All Progressives Congress, APC. The dispute centers around the revocation of a two-hectare plot of land in Yola, initially designated for a model school in the name of public interest. Fintiri's lawyer, Barrister Desmond Adewale, contacted the official narrative asserting that a revoc revocation was driven by political motives rather than a genuine commitment to public welfare. Adewale argued in court that the governor's decision had no intention of building a model school and was, in fact, an illegal and politically motivated act. Speaking to the media after the court session, Adewale revealed that the fear of losing ownership prompted Babazango to seek legal intervention. Has a right to invoke title to any piece of land for overriding public interest. I hear the governor wants to establish a school, which is overriding public interest. Recognized by Section 28 of the land use act. The governor acted on that. And the plaintiffs have come to court to challenge the action of the government. And the law says that before you file any suit against the state government or any of its agents, you must give reaction notice of 30 days. So you cannot come to court without serving the reaction notice. The Council for Babazango contended that the government's reliance on the Adamawa limitations of law was misplaced as imminent threats and human rights violations warranted immediate legal action, circumventing the need for a pre action notice. In response, the government's council barrister Bayomi Akumade defended Fintory's rights to revoke the land for overriding public interest, citing Section 28 of the Land Use Act. Our case before the court is a case of unlawful revocation, illegal revocation of the title of the plaintiffs of my client to the land. And uh, what we are saying is that uh, the reason for the revocation is political. It's not for public interest. And the reason why we are saying it's political is that if you look before the 2023 general election, most especially presidential and governorship election, mm -hmm. the APC as the party sought to use the battle square mm -hmm. as a campaign center. The government refused them. Mm -hmm. And my client, being a stakeholder mm -hmm. in the government, in the party, APC, mm -hmm. decided to allow them to use that particular place as their land. Mm. My brother, that was the genesis of his problem with the present uh, government. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.